I'm not in Bilbao yet. Um, I'm in Biarritz, south of France. So basically, I took a bus last night from Paris at 11 o'clock. Um, so I slept in that bus. It wasn't that bad, except the fact that I was really cold all night. But uh, apart from that, I, I managed to sleep a little bit, so that's okay. Um, anyway, it's 11 o'clock now. Uh, I had a breakfast at this place that you saw before. Um, actually, if you come to Biarritz one day, Biarritz, um, this place is called La Cantine and I don't recommend it at all. Don't go there. It's really like it was probably the worst coffee I've had in a while. Uh, and service was really poor and it was expensive. So it was cute, but not good at all. Um, anyway, I have a bus to take to Bilbao in about one hour, but I really wanted to go uh, to come here and see the sea from before, and I'm glad I did because it's really, really cute. Uh, so yeah, now I'm just gonna have to rush back and get my bus. for a few hours now um, basically the bus dropped me around 3 p.m. at the bus station and then I walked towards my hostel uh, and on the way I found a really nice vegetarian place to have lunch and then I just went to the hostel rested a little bit had a shower and basically when I came back out uh, it was pouring rain so I just started a coffee shop had a coffee did a little bit of shopping while waiting for the rain to stop and now it finally stopped and I came to the Guggenheim Museum so if you know Bilbao you probably know it for the Guggenheim Museum which is the modern art museum and I'm actually not going to go there this time because I've done it before I came here on a school trip um, about 10 years ago I think to this museum and I actually really really liked it and I think from the outside it's so cool, like it's so beautiful. Walking on this bridge while the water was spraying was so cool, like we couldn't see anything. Yeah, it was so cool, I just, I love this place. Um, I think now I'm gonna go back to the hostel, get some rest because tomorrow morning I have to get a bus really, really early. Also, this is a work of art called the spider. I don't like it that much.
so I'm not in Bilbao anymore. I took a bus this morning. Uh, I'm about one hour away uh, to the seaside and uh, there is one special place that I want to see and it was a place I wanted to see from the moment I booked my trip here so I'm not there yet. I have to walk a few kilometers because it's quite complicated to come here on the weekends because uh, there no, there's no buses but anyway the view here is already stunning and it's going to be beautiful. Pretty sure the walk is going to be worth it. here and it's not even my final point was not easy but definitely worth it it's so pretty I'm gonna try and find something to eat now I'm on my way back now the mission to find something to eat failed completely because there was just one restaurant there well actually two one of them opens at 1 30 Spanish people eat quite late and the second one was like a tapas bar so I went there and asked for something vegetarian and you said oh yeah and he started taking a tortilla so I said no eggs and he said no nothing the buffet was huge but there was nothing with just cheese or vegetables yeah I knew this was coming so I had dried peaches with me and some chocolate sweets <sighs> I'll eat when I come back to Bilbao
bago and I've had lunch, I've had a coffee, I've rested a little bit because I was exhausted by the work this morning and I'm walking through this huge park and I found this place which is absolutely stunning. I think it's called the Pagola and because it's spring it's full of these purple flowers. I think they're called wisteria, I'm not really sure. Uh, but the smell is amazing because they are just everywhere. It's so pretty, so so beautiful. Mm -hmm.